controlling moisture beneath the living area involves several important considerations during the design, construction, and maintenance of a raised floor home. Proper drainage is essential for keeping the foundation and underfloor areas dry. The site's finish grade should slope away from the home to provide positive drainage. For open pier and beam foundations on a level site, a slight crowning of the soil beneath the home helps drain water away. When a continuous wall foundation is used, building codes require ventilation of the enclosed crawl space. Vent openings provide cross ventilation of the underfloor area. These openings are screened to keep out pests. The number and size of vents required depends on the total area of the crawl space. Inside the crawl space, plastic sheeting is used as a vapor barrier to moisture from the ground. For many raised floor homes, the crawl space is a convenient location for plumbing and the ductwork, through floor trusses or between joists. Insulation is carefully installed beneath the subfloor. This can be either standard bat insulation or a spray foam insulation. Periodically, inspect the crawl space for excessive moisture from leaking plumbing, the ductwork, or standing water. Using pressure-treated wood to build the raised floor system is a proven way to control damage from moisture and termites. Local climatic conditions will dictate the specific design and construction details for a particular raised floor system. For more information about building a home with a raised wood floor, visit raisedfloorliving.com.